hi everyone the question is the number of real numbers x such that there exists an isosceles triangle having two of its angles measured in degrees equal to 2x plus 7 and 7x plus 10 is so here uh, since 2x plus 7 and 7x plus 10 are uh, supposed to be angles in degrees so you would say first of all 2x plus 7 and 7x plus 10 both should be greater than 0 because they are angles of a triangle and uh, both should be less than 180 of course in degrees i am talking about yeah x is supposed to be in degrees because 2x plus 7 and 7x plus 10 are in degrees yeah now uh, for uh, you know these to be angles of an isosceles triangle one possibility is what let me call it as case one these two angles turn out to be equal angles yeah in which case you have 5x equal to minus 3 x equal to minus 3 by 5 so uh, for x equal to minus 3 by 5 uh, you know are both of both of them are equal but are they uh, in this interval 0 and 180 absolutely yes check it out minus 6 by 5 plus 7 uh, is, is positive yeah and uh, both are, are uh, you know in between 0 and 180 in fact their sum should also be in this interval 0 to 180 yeah uh, their sum uh, which is what uh, 9x plus 17 should be uh, less than 180 and greater than 0 so essentially what you have to consider is you have to consider uh, you know both of them being positive and their sum being uh, less than 180 uh, other two things or three things whatever you may want to say are all you know automatically taken care of because if the sum itself is less than 180 then they individually definitely would be less than 180 why because they are individually positive and if they are individually positive their sum would definitely be positive yeah so uh, even when you take x to be minus 3 by 5 uh, you know this expression 9x plus 17 turns out to be less than 180 so this is acceptable what about the other possibility the other possibility is what let's say 2x plus 7 is the repeated angle is the uh, you know the angle which are equal so that means what that means 2 times 2x plus 7 plus 7x plus 10 should be equal to 180 yeah i mean because if this is the uh, you know repeated angle uh, then that means this is the third angle so their sum should be 180 yeah so you get what 4x plus 7x 11x uh, 14 plus 10 uh, you know 24 equal to 180 so you get what x to be uh, whatever you may say uh, you know 156 by 11 yeah now uh, you know they should individually be positive absolutely yes they are for this value of x and uh, their sum should be less than 180 it is automatically taken care of why because 2 times 2x plus 7 plus 7x plus 10 is equal to 180 then 1 times 2x plus 7 plus 7x plus 10 would definitely be less than 180 so yes even this is acceptable similarly you will have a case 3 where 7x plus 10 is the uh, you know uh, repeated angle and you have 2x plus 7 plus 2 times 7x plus 10 uh, equal to 180 so here what you have is uh, 16x plus 27 is equal to 180 so you have x equal to uh, you have 153 by 16 so even this uh, seems to be acceptable uh, due to the same reason so answer should be d thanks for listening